Tracy Sanders, owner and chief veterinarian of Aquatic Veterinary Services. Today we'll be talking about probably the most common parasite that we see is Trichodina. Now, Trichodina, if you've ever seen those scrubbing bubble commercials, um, essentially it looks like that. It's a little circle, has little raspy teeth around the middle, and essentially they just kind of swirl around your fish, crunching on all the tasty little mucus and skin they can find. And these guys are super, super irritating. Uh, usually they stick to the skin, but in very severe infestations, they've actually I found them in the gills. So, again, the gills aren't their primary target, but this is a very common parasite. And again, it's one of those ones that's very easily treated, provided that it hasn't seen, you know, 5,000 different medications come down the line already, um, putting the fish in jeopardy. So, again, very easily diagnosed, a uh, little scrubbing bubble, fun fun signs. Again, it's not anything that's a macroscopic parasite. The only signs that you're going to see is your fish flashing, doing that kind of pancake, swim. Um, sometimes they'll do little jerky swims too. Um, sometimes they jump and land on the water surface and the, the surface tension of the water helps itch the parasites off. So that's really the only thing you're going to see with Trichodina and many other parasites. So it's very important that they are diagnosed quickly and effectively and correctly and therefore you will have the best treatment and make sure it's an effective one rather than some crap you pulled off the pet store shelves. So that is our spiel about Trichodina. If you have any questions about other fish parasites or any other fish health concerns, please visit our website at cafishvet.com. At Aquatic Veterinary Services, fish are treated like family.